Hi friends, I'm Miss Anna and <clears throat> and this is Sylvester Sloth. Welcome to Storytime. Thanks, Sylvester. Today I have another story for you from my incredible book of stories. Today's story is about one of my favorite animals of all time. Can you guess what it is? <clears throat> uh, no, sorry. It's not a sloth. My favorite animal is a shark. But don't be scared. Today's story is all about being brave and growing up. Let's read our story, shall we? Okay, here we go. When Sakina Shark was a baby, she had very small teeth, the size of pumpkin seeds. They were sharp like her parents' teeth, but not strong enough to eat the same foods her parents ate. That's okay, Sakina thought. I like my small teeth. They make me look less scary. When baby sharks are born, they have small, smooth teeth. But adult sharks have larger, jagged teeth. Hmm. I wonder how they get to be big and jagged. Let's find out. But Sakina wasn't a baby anymore. She was growing up now, becoming a bigger, stronger shark than she was when she was a baby shark. One day, as she was swimming along, she felt something strange. One of her very small, less scary teeth was loose. She felt it wiggling and jiggling around in her mouth. Have you ever had a loose tooth? What about you? What did it feel like? Could you wiggle and jiggle it around inside your mouth with the tip of your tongue? That can feel fun and even silly. <laughs> Let's see how Sakina felt about having a loose tooth. Oh no, Sakina worried. If I can lose my teeth, what's next? Will I lose my fins too? My tail? My eyes? Sakina couldn't stop worrying. She tried to swim very slowly and carefully so nothing else would come loose. Exactly. Her friend Remy Ramora noticed her swimming in a strange way and came up beside her. Um, are you okay? You're swimming kind of funny, Remy said. I'm definitely not okay, Sakina answered. Everything is falling apart and I'm worried. Everything is falling apart, Remy echoed. Well, not everything, but my tooth is very wiggly and jiggly and I'm worried it's gonna fall out and if I can lose my teeth, what's next? My fins? My tail? My eyes? Wow, Sakina is really worried, huh? Sometimes when I'm worried, it's very hard to get settled back down. Pretend that you're in a place where you feel calm and safe. Try it with me. Close your eyes if it helps you to imagine. Ah. I already feel better. What about you? Remy gave Sakina a moment to find her calm and then responded. Sakina, I know you're worried. Change can be scary, but everyone has to lose their baby teeth. It's your body's way of saying, it's time to grow up. And that's a great thing. You won't lose your fins or your tail or your eyes. Those will just keep getting bigger and stronger. But why do my teeth have to fall out? Sakina argued. Because your body needs different food now to get bigger and stronger. So your body's making bigger, more jagged teeth to be able to eat that food, Remy answered. Wow, that's amazing. As your body grows, it makes new teeth to help you eat food to make you big and strong. Did you know that great white sharks continue to lose their teeth and grow more teeth even as grown-ups? Wow! Yeah, that's right. They have rows and rows of teeth that are ready to chomp just in case they lose one. See? Wow, that's a lot of teeth. People don't have rows and rows of teeth like sharks do. Neither do sloths. But when we lose our baby teeth, New teeth grow in their place to help us to eat the foods that make us big and strong. Sakina thought and thought about this. She felt better knowing she wouldn't lose her fins or her tail or her eyes. And it was pretty amazing that her body would make new teeth for her. She took a deep breath, blowing lots of bubbles through her gills and said, okay, 
I can be brave and remember that my body is growing up. At that very moment, her tooth jiggled one last time and floated out of her mouth down to the bottom of the ocean floor. It didn't hurt her one tiny bit and she still had her fins and her tail and her eyes. Remy Ramora cheered. Hooray! You're so brave, Sakina. Sakina smiled big, one little gap in her teeth, ready for a bigger, more jagged tooth to come. The end. When you have wiggly jiggly teeth, it can sometimes make you feel a little bit worried. But losing your little teeth means your body is ready to grow up big and strong, and that's amazing. Let me see your muscles. Oh, wow, you're so strong. You're strong too, Sylvester. <laughs> and when you get your big teeth, you'll be able to grow even bigger and stronger than you are now. Thank you so much for being here with me and Sylvester Sloth for story time. We'll see you next time, friends. Can you wave to our friends, Sylvester? Bye! I thought of a song to go along with our story today. Could I sing it for you? Okay, great. It goes like this. I can eat, eat, eat with my brand new teeth. I can smile so big and wide. When my baby teeth wiggle and jiggle around, it's time to say goodbye. New teeth come when little teeth go. I'm so brave and strong. If I get worried when my tooth gets loose, I'll remember to sing this song.